All right, first and foremost, JJ, I'm having a flashback here. I believe I bought a tie over there, a little Tommy Hilfiger Ralph Lauren deal over there, and I got a gift from my mom over here, some jewelry. We're at the old Elder Bearman downtown. We're going to talk about that in a little bit. But first of all, tell us about Encore Theater. What are you guys all about? Great. So, uh, Encore Theater Company is all about taking new musicals or uh, rarely produced musicals and bringing them to the Dayton community. We also um, bring in. Um, new works from New York and stuff and that way they can test drive their stuff here in Dayton where it's kind of a it's a safe environment and then the cast and the members are who just folks from all over the community yeah yeah uh, we got some people who just graduated from high school we have one girl who's still in high school actually uh, a couple college graduates so all over the Dayton area so a nice mix and you guys were performing all over the place and then this space came about tell us about this space and and this is your first show in this space absolutely absolutely um, we got this space through uh, Peter Benkendorf, actually, of the Blue Sky Project. So there you go. See how everything kind of comes together. All right, now Spring Awakening is on right now. Uh, briefly tell the folks what's what's it all about. Um, it's kind of about uh, adolescence and discovering uh, sexuality and uh, you kind can of say that. I can you say, can I can say, say that sexuality, <laughs> um, d discovering discovering uh, who people are and and why they love and why you love. So how excited are you guys to have this space? Oh God, we're thrilled. We couldn't be happier with it. I mean, the the fact that we can meld this industrial look with the world of 1891 for the show is truly incredible. And I think the best way it could be executed is by being in this space. All right, you owe yourself to come on down and check out Spring Awakening right here at Courthouse Crossing, the old Elder Beerman building, right? All right, WDTN.com. Go to Booker's Beat for more information. And before we go, you know, if there were suits over there and sweaters and things, I'd get you something. I would have bought you something, but you know, unfortunately, they're not here anymore, so I can't do that, JJ. But <laughs> the thought that reason. counts, right? Absolutely. A for effort. All right, from downtown, Jim Booker, 2 News. <laughs>